Hello, this is Angie with Spada Home Barcelona. Today we are visiting a three bedroom apartment with one bathroom located on the fifth floor. Uh, we are off of, of the street Carrera de Arago and this is in the Sagrada Familia neighborhood. Um, so the Sagrada Familia is like about, I think about five minute walk from here and you also have the metro station L2. Uh, the station is called Monumento and that's only about a five minute walk from here as well. Um, there's also a lot of buses that you can take so this is a really good area for uh, commuting and you're only about 10 to 15 minutes away from the main city center like Plata Catalunya. Okay, so that is a little bit about the area and I'm going to show you the rest of the space. So let's go. Okay, so here's the front door and we're located on the fifth floor again and there is an elevator to take so that's a great plus. Right when you walk in you have uh, the living room ahead of you and towards the right there is the kitchen, bathroom and bedrooms. But first let's take a look at this uh, entry area. So you have a space for your shoes. Okay. And there's a mirror right here. And as we enter the living room you see it's very spacious, it's big and bright. Uh, see, so you have a TV with a TV stand, a little lamp over there, a couch to fit at least three to four people with coffee table and extra chairs. And on this side of the room, you have a table with four chairs to have a meal or do your study. And across the room here, you also have some more office space, desk space uh, to do some work. So here's a look. And we're going to now going to go ahead and visit the balcony. So there's a little table with two chairs, a perfect spot to have like a morning coffee. And here's the view from the balcony. Okay. And straight down this hallway here, you have the kitchen and all the other bedrooms. So first I'll visit the kitchen. And as you can see, it's very clean, white and bright. Here's good counter space. To be from this side. All right, so let's take a closer look. So there's a refrigerator. It's a good size refrigerator in my opinion. Okay, plenty of space. You have a microwave, a dishwasher, an oven, and also a gas uh, stove with four burners. Let's take a look at the cupboards. Looks like some cleaning supplies. Oop. Knives, forks, spoons, more kitchen items. And looks like that's a food storage area. And underneath the sink we have looks like some pots and pans. Okay. And as you can see this kitchen is fully equipped. It has everything you need. All right, now next to the kitchen is the area to do your laundry. So here's your washing machine. There is a drying rack right here. And also you can dry your clothing on these lines right here as well. All right. Okay, so down this hallway we have bedroom number one, uh, which we will not visit today because it's currently occupied. And we have bedroom number two right here. It's a single bedroom with a desk and a side table. You have a TV right there. Uh, the view is the view that we just saw of the, the laundry area. And on this side of the room you have a closet with another side table. So take a look at the closet and you have plenty of hanging space and storage space. Okay, here's a view of the desk with a lamp and a chair. All right, so that is bedroom number two. Now we're gonna visit uh, the bedroom number three. And as you can see, it's a pretty much the same decor. It's a bit a bit bigger room, but it still has a single bed. It has a desk and chair, like just like bedroom number two. And you have a chest of drawers, a standalone closet, there's a heater. I forgot to show you the heater in bedroom number two. It does have one as well. And we have the same closet here. Okay, a little lamp next to your bed. 
And it looks like you have some storage space down here, which is a plus as well. Okay, so the view from the room is also the same as the laundry area in bedroom number two. There you are. Now we'll visit uh, the bathroom. There's your toilet, a little storage area right there with the window, sink, a mirror, and here's your shower. Okay, so there's some storage space here. I'll show you very quickly. Plenty of space. And also over here. Plenty of space. Okay, so that is it today. Again, we're in the Sagara Familia uh, neighborhood. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. This is Angie with Spot Home Barcelona, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.